Mom gives birth and screams after seeing baby. Doctors reveal something much worse after. Starting a family is often thought to be one of the biggest leaps of faith you can take with someone that you're in a relationship with. At that point, it no longer becomes just about the two of you. It becomes more so about the new form life that the two of you chose to create together as a result of your love. But in the case of Sharon Kujik, starting a family and finally welcoming a new life into this world quickly turned into something she thought was only possible in her worst nightmares. Sharon and her husband were absolutely thrilled to learn that Sharon had become pregnant with their first child. The two had always dreamed of starting a family together, so this was definitely a dream come true. Word quickly spread all around where they lived in Harare, Zimbabwe, and everyone congratulated the couple regarding the great news. The couple had also bought a bunch of new stuff for their baby to be, and even converted a room in their home into a nursery so that the baby could be as comfortable as possible. Sharon went on to have a very normal and healthy pregnancy. She ate extremely well and healthy, took all of her prenatal vitamins, and just all around did everything the optimal way, like her doctor had advised her to do. Sharon also didn't experience much morning sickness either, which was a huge sigh of relief because that was one thing she wasn't looking forward to in the slightest. Before they even knew it, Sharon and her husband were on their way to the hospital because she just started going into labor. Time had definitely flown by since the pregnancy announcement. Everything was going great until the baby started coming out. Instead of head first, the baby's legs were the first part of its body to start coming out. No big deal. While this definitely isn't ideal by any means, most of the time everything should still go relatively smoothly. But things looked a bit strange as the baby continued to come out and be born, to the point where the nurses and doctors in the delivery room began to grow concerned. Sharon was able to pick up on this, but had no choice but to keep focusing on giving birth to her new baby. Finally, when the baby was all the way out and born, the nurses screamed and left it for the doctor to deal with by himself. When the doctor came back into the delivery room with the baby and showed it to Sharon, she was immediately taken back. The baby had peeling skin, an odd-shaped head, and a purple-covered face. Its eyes were also purple in color and completely dark. Sharon didn't even want to hold her baby because its appearance scared her. In fact, at first, she didn't even want her husband coming back into the delivery room to see the baby because she feared he'd have the same reaction that she did when she first laid eyes on the baby. Needless to say, all the doctors and nurses were completely taken by surprise and confused because they'd never seen anything like this before. Everything about Sharon's pregnancy was completely normal, and she never did anything that would have the slightest risk of harming the baby. When what she wanted to do regarding the condition of the baby, Sharon absolutely refused to have anything to do with it. She claimed that the baby must have been a mistake and that its appearance made her feel uncomfortable. She also even refused to refer to the baby as a baby at all. She kept referring to it as a creature instead. After her recovery, Sharon and her husband went home without the baby. The baby ended up passing away a few short days later anyway.